Bishop of the Anglican Church of Kenya, Jackson Olesapit, wants Kenyans to stop piling pressure on the government to reopen schools. Meanwhile, Anab Koi, Member of Parliament, William Chipkut, has asked the government not to reopen schools until COVID-19 and the flood situation around the country is fixed. Kenyans have until May 22nd to submit their memoranda to the COVID-19 National Education Response Committee. But even as the committee continues to receive views on how best to reopen schools, leaders have not stopped talking. We urge parents and guardians to be patient and not to pile pressure on school opening to allow the task force to provide a clear roadmap. Whereas reopening of schools will largely depend on how best the country will have managed COVID-19, a section of leaders from the Rift Valley are asking the government to address the challenges facing children from flood-prone areas before reopening of schools. Was above 29 counties work on a flood. Sasa watafungua mashule na 29 counties awako kwa manyumba. All their infrastructures of schools, schools have been spoiled. Mm. The floods being experienced across the country have claimed more than 200 lives while displacing thousands of families. Many schools in the affected areas are now serving as rescue centers and camps for the flood victims. But in northeastern, a section of leaders are calling upon the government to suspend national examinations as the only way to ensure equality among all candidates. Ijara Member of Parliament Sophia Abdi says many families in Garissa County and the larger northeastern region are not ready for the exams. You cannot tell me that the child in Abalatiro and the child in Nairobi will do the same papers. We will not accept that, Minister of Education. We will not accept that and we are telling you you are creating two classes of education system in this country. But Kenya Secondary School Heads Association Chairman Kahi Indemoli wants schools to reopen by end of June in order to allow for adequate time to prepare for exams. Should the pandemic go down and we have to uh, get back to schools, we need to sit down and come up with the, uh, the roadmap on how we need to prepare for the children to come uh, to school. Otherwise, it is our prayer that uh, by the end of this month, the Ministry of Health uh, will be able to give the green light for the Ministry of Education to direct that schools can, can reopen. Education Cabinet Secretary Professor George Magoha had extended closure of schools to June 4th. However, the extension of the dusk to dawn curfew to the 6th of June by President Uhuru Kenyatta is a telling sign that schools are unlikely to reopen in June. Nevertheless, a report by the COVID-19 National Education Response Committee will inform when and how learning will resume. Shadrach Miti, KT News.